go, what are we making today? Yes. Um, Everybody's favorite dessert. Everyone's favorite dessert. Um, oh, I know, avocado on a stick. No. Uh, is it? I'm not sure, what is it? Chocolate chip cookie. Chocolate chip. The chocolate chip cookie. I have never shared this recipe before. Ever. 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 So you guys are the first and only ones to get this recipe. Oh my goodness. Thank you so much for that. And then we're going to stuff them with ice cream. Oh, oh! <laughs> when you thought it was going to just get better. So we're going to have an ice cream sandwich. We're going to start with the ingredients for the cookie. Okay. We need a half a cup of butter, three quarters of a cup of brown sugar, one quarter cup of white sugar, and then that will be one egg, a teaspoon of vanilla, one and three quarter cups of flour, one tablespoon of cornstarch, and that is the secret. Cornstarch makes the cookie moist. Mm. After that, a half a teaspoon of baking soda, half a teaspoon of baking powder, and of course, I use chocolate chunks, but you can use chocolate chips, anything you want. Nuts, as you wish. The right. more chocolate, the better. That's right. Okay, so we'll start mixing the ingredients. I've got my bowl. We'll start with the butter. You don't want it melted. But you don't want it hard from the fridge. I'm gonna cut it up so it's easy to mix it. I'm gonna whip it up a bit and then we're gonna add the sugars. And add our sugars. Now we're gonna add our egg. I suggest that you always crack your egg and put it in a bowl. That way you won't have any shells. Not on my stuff are always crunchy. Ah, I get it now. A little bit at a time, so that we don't get the mess. <laughs> starch, my baking soda, baking powder, and just a pinch of salt. Not too much salt guys, no. just a pinch, a not a bottle. That's good. We're going to add our chocolate, whether you use chips, chunks, as you wish. A whole chocolate bar, would that work? Yeah, it's a whole cup worth. Okay, we're going to mix that by hand. Oh. We're in the dining hall now, and uh, we're at the point of where we're going to roll our cookies, and uh, we're going to put them on a, a lined parchment paper she uh, baking sheet. So we're going to shape them into a ball. We're just gonna, you can use a scoop if you like, but otherwise, it doesn't have to be perfect. If you find that it's easier to put a little bit of oil on your hands, Ooh, a trick. Okay, so it doesn't, uh, it won't stick. Well, just like that. You can make them into different shapes. You can make heart shapes. You can make diamonds. You can make it into a cake, a big, a really big cookie. <gasps> oh, really works can you imagine like a, a pizza of cookie dough? Okay. Now we're going to put them in the oven. The oven has been preheated to 275. And 
You hear the fan? That's the convection part. Ah. Okay. Put a timer on for 15 minutes, and we'll check them after that. We'll see you in 15 minutes. Oh no, Virgo, what's Sorry, happening? What's ready. happening? Oh, the cookies are ready! Turn off the bell, turn off the oven. Wow, look at that. Mm. Wow, Virgo. We see how they're more golden. So many cookies. This was a double batch, right, yes, Virgo? Yeah. So now we're when, when I make them in the summer, it's twenty batches at a time. Twenty yes, batches. Because there's a lot of you. There's a hundred people to feed. So we're gonna cool them off now, um, because right now you can't pick it up. See, it'll break. Our cookies are cooled now. We've taken them out of the oven. We actually refrigerated them for a few minutes to make it go faster. So now we have our ice cream here. You can use any flavor. What I did was I take took 10 cookies and flipped them upside down, okay? So the ice cream will go on this side, on the flat side, and then we're gonna to top it with the other cookie. Okay, and wet our scoop. Why do you wet your scoop? It releases from the, from the scoop. Otherwise um. it can get stuck. Okay, so we're gonna take our cookie, put our scoop in there. And take the other cookie, and you're gonna push. And because the cookies are still not hot, not cold, they're flexible, you see? They won't break. Clean it off if you have some like that. Okay, these are chocolate sprinkles. Ooh. See how nice that is? How long in the freezer? About an hour. Okay, so keep on going. We'll put that right in the freezer, right? Right in the freezer, yeah. Yeah, the rest of them, we're just gonna do them with ice cream. Virgo? Yes? If we don't have a scoop at home, what can we use to put it in so it's easy? Ooh, that's a great question. In they go. Chocolate itself is already pretty much solidified. And there you have it, ice cream sandwiches. Would you want to try one? Yeah, I would love to try one. Uh, it's huge. Take a big bite, guys. Mm. Mm. I know the ice cream will be melting soon. Yes. But my heart is melting already because it's so delicious. Oh man. Oh man. Oh man. If you make this at home, please send it to us. Uh, not the ice cream, that would melt. But send a picture to us, okay? At media.cantmasswithy at gmail.com.